Hola, hello, marhaba, salut, welcome again to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing a review about the newest lipstick or lip balm by L'Oreal. They have three collections, that is uh, the glossy balm, the new balm and the pop balm. <laughs> but they are almost the same, so if you like to know what I think about this a uh, new collection and some swatches on my lips. Stay with me. I know it all. And I want to tell you they are similar to the Color Whisper, but they are not the same. They are way more pigmented than the Color Whisper. As the name by Maybelline Color Whisper is like a whisper of color in your lips. I will swatch it up the number 60 Pale, Pale Rebel. Um, which is the pinkish color of that collection. I don't know if it's still on stores. I don't remember it. And I will swatch it all the moss um, similar from the... This is the Pop Bomb, which is called Electric Pink. And it's really pigmented. I will show you this swatch. So the color doesn't look like the same same color, but you can see the, pigment the pigmentation is way more. This one here is the number 60 Petal Rebel and here is the Electric Paint by L'Oreal, the collection that we are talking right now. I think the pigmentation is really good and they are also kind of different, so no, they are not the same. The collection which is come in crayon format, which is like this, similar to the Revlon ones that you just, um, they are retractable and I really like the, the packaging because have these really beautiful silver cap and then have the the name of the thing and the color is really similar to the one that you're gonna get on your lips so you can tell by the color also it has the name on here this one what I get is what I got on the store is 240 pick me up and it's really pigmented see this one is really pigmented also, this uh, glossy balm, uh, this format of the collection is really moisturizing and I really like them because they last, not forever, but they really last long. It has some kind of a stain on your lips, but which I, what I hate about it is it start to come off on the middle of your lips and you just end with a line surrounding your lips, which is doesn't look like really pretty, so you have to top it off top it on many times but they really last like one hour without eating or drinking anything <laughs> you know what I mean so they doesn't last forever but they are really good pigmentation and they are really durable so. the yeah. next one I'm gonna show you is like a nudist color but also have like a rosy thing it's, it's really unique color I really like it also it's the same packaging like this and this this one is the 260 vintage rose I love it I love it so much this one is more for a special occasion but this one is for daily uses the next collection is called the pop balm and there are four chains but I only got one I only got two of them the first one is 440 and it's called electric pink I really like this color is real pigmented pinkish color and they come in a this uh, lipstick format that I have like a thin tube and then a square base and all and the transparent cap which have the name and also the kind of color and they have the sticker right here this is the four 440 electric pink. I really like the packaging. It's really unique. It's similar to the lipstick that L'Oreal has, like this goldish color. But they are really cute and practical. Also, I have to mention they are not really actual lipsticks. They are um, just lip balms like you put on and are really pigmented. I really like it as I mentioned in the beginning, like daily uses. Like, you don't have that shock of color on your lips. They're just, you know, they be a little pigmented, but you're really modest during the day. Okay, uh, <laughs> on the Pop Bone collection, it's 430 and it's Fergie Red and it's a reddish color. 
it has some kind of um, sparkle things which is not really shimmery it's like setting color and I really like this color it's like the perfect way to wear red in your work or school because you're wearing, wearing red I love red so I don't know if you are like me I love wearing red but this one is like a nobody know it is like she have fire in her mouth <laughs> so yeah I really like it so this collection have four shades and they are seven, seven eighty. I got them on Walgreens, and I'm, I think I pay like eight dollars for each two. It's called Nude Bomb, and I got the all four shades because I do love nude color. So the first one, the first one is um, eight hundred eighteen, which is a real pale color. It's like a brownish color, but it also is a really nude color. I really like this color because um, even though I'm white, um, I'm afraid to wear nude lipstick sometimes because they make me look pale and sick. But this one is it's okay because it's more to the brownish color than to the skin thing. <laughs> so yeah, this is pretty good if you really like um, new colors. So I am. I'm suggesting that you got the A A18, which is called No Showing Nude. The next one, oh no, that's not the next one. <laughs> the next one is 819, which is a tone up. Is a new, it's still being a new color, but a little darker tone. And this one is called Caramel Comfort. This one is one of my favorite because, as you can see in the swatches, um, it's really they look so perfect. It's make the perfect new thing. The next one I will to show you is a 218 Rose Elixir. This one is not really pigmented. Maybe it's because the pigmentation of my lips made it so hard to resolve, you know, like to look at. But I think it's so pretty. And that's why I got it because it's a really rosy nude color. And also it's really like clear on your lips. I don't know, I think it's melted with my lips so perfect. Maybe you don't um, see, see him very well on the swatch, but I think I like him. I don't know. And the last one of the new collection is a 219 Blush Plum. And it's a plum color. What I don't know what it's doing in the new thing. I, thought, I didn't know Plum was considered a new color. So is this one just right here have a little bit of shimmer but it's really dark. This one probably is the one I think is the most pigmented or you can see it more. Probably for pale girls, probably in a dark complexion wouldn't show off like in us. Uh, I don't know. Probably. Maybe they can rock other colors that I cannot. <laughs> um the packaging is the same one, just is the name change. Actually, I didn't know it was three, collect three, three collections. I thought it was only two, the gradients of the lipstick. So that's everything for this today. I hope you like it, and I see you on my next video. Bye-bye.